Welcome to the 100 hour overnight survival challenge. We're each gonna be getting different budgets to survive 100 hours out in the woods. Every morning, we're gonna be able to drop again to get new budgets, to expand your empire, build new shelters, get more snacks, whatever you want. I'm gonna do a different drop method each time, starting with Beam. Uh oh. Hoping for something big. Yeah, 250, that'll get me far for day one. Pretty good. Pretty solid. This first drop is actually pretty important. It sets the stage for the whole overnight. Science. Yes, yeah, science. Science rules. Come on, come on. Uh oh. Oh my God. A thousand dollars. I told you this first drop is important. I told you. Doc. What? <laughs> Back to, back to the future. Hey man, talk, 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 talk. Whoa! 125. I can work with that. Time to go to the store and get our supplies. Let the 100 hours begin. First stop, REI, the best place to get all kinds of survival gear. I'm not anticipating that I get the big budget again tomorrow, so I'm gonna prioritize shelter, the best sleeping bag, and the most comfortable cot possible. The Hubba Hubba 2 sleeping tent is $500. Everything you need to survive is super expensive, so I'm focusing on the essentials. I'm having way more luck at shield. I have a tent here, this will be 40 bucks, so that's actually really good. All I need is a sleeping bag, and then probably just a snack or something like that. Boom, $30 sleeping bag. I have figured out what I'm gonna build. This 10 by 10 instant canopy, it's only 80 bucks. Gives me a lot more room to get a sleeping bag and maybe some other accessories that's gonna get below 30 degrees. And as you can see, all these sleeping bags are pretty pricey. Just found a clearance sleeping bag, $12. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> You're not gonna believe what I just found. I have never heard of this existing before. It's 130 bucks. This is definitely gonna allow me to sleep throughout the night. So I gotta get it. Back in the woods, it's time to build. First things first, I'm gonna get the canopy set up and see what I have to work with. The guy said that this cot should fit in here no problem. So if it doesn't fit, I'm gonna be so mad. What is that? I'm not done. Mine's gonna be super quick set up because I only got like three things. Oh, a little pink bow. 40 bucks, I'm actually insanely impressed I got a tent. I need help from friends to open up my canopy. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> Moment of truth, guys. I only had enough money to buy four of these emergency blankets, so we'll see how much this will cover for the wall. If you don't have a hammer to do your tent stakes, find something in the woods, for example, a big brick. Oh, I ripped it, no. Why did I do that? Oh, no. Giant hole now. Justin is really struggling over there. He went a little too experimental too soon. It's gonna be a disastrous <laughs> night for you. As a friend, I'm hoping that he gets a big budget tomorrow to improve his shelter, but as his competitor, I hope not. <laughs> Check out my bed, folks. You didn't even see this yet. Let me squish. Oh. I only have four of these things, and I'm already having issues because the whole thing ripped in half. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Don't ever buy this. Oh. oh. <laughs> How is this supposed to stay down? It just flops up. What? Oh my gosh. This is literally the worst cot I've ever seen. <laughs> oh yeah. I've already got so many plans for upgrades for my house. This is the item I've been so excited about. Looks like a normal chair, but it's actually a heated chair. And since it's gonna be cold tonight, I think I'm gonna be sitting in this all night. Oh, I gotta do a little more tape work. It covers 75% of my canopy. All I need to do is lower the front end where there is no emergency blanket. So right here, just lower it, close it up, and I'm surrounded by emergency blankets and this hot chair. I think this is gonna work. We have all finished building our shelters for the first night of the 100 hour challenge. We're gonna give you guys a tour, starting with, I got the low budget, but don't worry, it's gonna get way better from here. One thing that I wish I had taken into account before staking my tent down was the ground. There's lots of rocks and sticks right here. That's gonna be the biggest problem with tonight is just the, the ground. Otherwise, I think I'll be warm. Got protection from the wind. I got enough food here. You just put water in and some kind of chemical reaction heats it up. Science! 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 This was a $30 sleeping bag. Got like a really nice lining. Like it's not just this on the inside. Oh yeah. Spent my last $15 on this light. It's nice. gonna get way cooler as the days go by. Next up, Justin. Obviously it didn't go as anticipated with the emergency blankets. Your vision kind of came together. This stuff is so thin. So where are you gonna sleep? Depending on how cold I am. I'm hoping that once I shut the canopy down and lay up here near that, 
should heat up the body along with the super 30 degree sleeping bag. It's just interesting because he got a smaller budget, but I feel more confident in his setup. I'm also like Isaac, envisioning the future. I can see the potential of this canopy. But unlike Isaac, you didn't first see the present. I, that's my problem. So <laughs> I'm, oh, oh my. Did you get any food? Glad yeah. Giant beef jerky stick, water, and a protein bar. But I, like I said, I put half of my budget into this hot chair. <laughs> okay, well, that makes sense. I hope that pays off for later in the episode. The moment we've all been waiting for, the tour of Andrew's luxurious $1,000 setup. What do you got? This is the green turtle. Yeah, it does look like a turtle. Well, so why did you go with this tent? Obviously $1,000. Because I got a lot of other accessories that are gonna pay off. Nice, I mean, this is a padded cot with this 20 degree Big Timber Pro sleeping bag. I've got the cooking section. This is the kitchen. I've got all my snacks. I got something prepared for breakfast. All the water I need. We've got coffee for in the morning on my coffee cup. And you're sitting in the relaxation chair, which has this nice wool blanket. Oh, don't fart on my bed. You will never be allowed back. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm literally right on my pillow. <laughs> How did you know I was gonna fart? You lifted your leg like a dog. <laughs> yeah. I gotta remake my bed from big butthole sitting on it. One thing I didn't mention about my budget, I saved about $25 for a special DoorDash delivery for dinner. We have three severe weather alerts. Significant threat to life or property. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. We have our lives and property out here. Winds with gusts up to 60 miles an hour. 60? That's like almost tornado style. <laughs> <laughs> Until 7 p.m. Friday. Today's Wednesday. Oh, so exactly when we're doing this challenge. So the whole 100 hour challenge, we're gonna be in this red flag severe wind warning. We basically spent the entire first day setting up our initial shelters and our first budgets and all that. Can't even see me right now, but let's test out this light. Oh, my chair has this light here, full power. I'm really hoping this gets hot. DoorDash, it was worth it. Check this out. Bird call. I got a whole bunch of chicken strips. I got some sweet tea. <sighs> Woo. Chicken pasta Parmesan. All you need to do is pour water in here and it heats itself up. Well, I missed most of the bag. I got a little puddle of water in my house. Got this peanut butter protein bar. Ah, oh, this is actually pretty good. <coughs> Whoa. That's some good chicken. I'm also gonna heat up my dessert, molten brownie. Oh, vegan. I'm going for an after dinner nature hike. The moon. The moon. My chair is actually starting to heat up and it's feeling good. Is this not how it works? I thought if I push this button, this side will go down, but maybe it doesn't because there's no way for it to do that. How did I not think of this? Oh my gosh, it was literally sitting there doing nothing and then all of a sudden the whole bag started shaking and bubbling and there's steam coming out of the little hole right here. That is the nuttiest thing. Wow, this is a very thin sleeping bag. That's annoying. I have messed up bad. Parmesan pasta. Ooh, doesn't smell too good. It's still pretty cold. Tastes pretty good, but uh... That. You wanna try some molten brownie? I thought this was weathered for 30 degrees. This looks pathetic, but this is what I have to do. I appreciate it, because I didn't really have dessert. No. There ain't nothing molten about that. You might not want one of these. Oh, what? Can I say that? <laughs> Don't show me that. This is getting pretty hot, too. A new hole in my wall. Who's laughing over there? <laughs> Good night, everybody. Good morning, New York. I gotta get more money to change this setup. For today's breakfast, all I have is this. <laughs> Hello? Let me guess. You're in paradise. Yeah. You're it was very comfy. I slept uh, pretty good. My stomach kind of hurt. Day one is officially complete, so it's time to drop for the next budget. It's a pop up. Spiders. Ah, I just don't get it. Let's go. Oh. Doc. 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 Same? That sucks. Paul Blart! Yellow. Peanut Blart and jelly. What? 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 Oh What's oh. up, man? Oh my! <laughs> what was that about? Dude, we are so <laughs> screwed. To the store. I don't know what this entails yet, but I think it's time for a truce. You prioritize your shelter. I'll get enough food so we can have like a nice little cookout or something. I'm going to have to be strategic with this one. You guys already know my mission is to expand the empire. So I'm getting another tent. This one's humongous. Oh. Giant cabin style tent. This will be the centerpiece of my village. We are now at Walmart, guys. Me and Isaac have no other choice. Even the kids' camping tents are too expensive for me. This thing alone is $35. And more stuff, huh? I gotta fill up my mega tent. We don't wanna come anyway. Right, Justin? Hey, I didn't say that. What? I... If he's inviting me over, 
I want to hang out, man. Six by eight foot tarp. Way better than those lame emergency blankets. And they're only $4.97. I'm going to have to be very frugal with the $10 I have left. I'm going to get one single banana because they're 58 cents a pound. We're back from the store shopping on day two of the 100 hour challenge. I'm gonna be setting up the mega tent. All of my emergency blanket walls have ripped from the bottom. You serious? I found this sweet barbecue. It was only $22, crazy cheap. There's no way this tarp is gonna rip. I've got mega tent set up and this thing is really cool because it's got two separate rooms with doors. One thing that I got was this solar panel power station. The faster I can get the solar panel set up and start charging this thing with the sun, the better. 21%. So we'll come back later to see how well it's doing. I am officially finished with my new setup and let me just say it's a big change. I have made it so my living quarters are just right in here. I am starving. Thankfully I was able to afford some berries so this should hold me over until dinner. What do you have for lunch? Hot dogs. Ooh! My mental clarity is already clearing up just being in this The mental hut. clarity is clearing up? Yeah. <laughs> Over there, it's kind of getting a little foggy. Well, follow me into the living room. This is where the snack station is going to be. Right now, I'm charging my cooler. Why would you need to charge your cooler? You'll hear later. I need to switch into my survival gear. I needed to upgrade the wardrobe a little bit. I'm hoping for a, a wardrobe upgrade tomorrow because currently I have holes in my pants. <laughs> I can fully stand up in this and I have plenty of headroom. I'm pretty proud of what I've done, but I'm also pretty embarrassed. Wow. It's a completely hey. different vibe, right? I'm proud of you. For $25, this is a pretty good upgrade. We're now gonna do our first versus challenge. We each get 10 minutes at the same time to go around whatever you can find in the woods around the property to craft your best trap. And if you win, automatic $200 budget boost. Three, two, one, go. Ow! My strategy is to use like a, a bucket like this, kind of prop it up so it's tilted and get a piece of food, string it from the inside so it's dangling. The animal comes in, the bucket falls on him. Dude, I don't know what the heck I'm doing. I found this like ribbon. That's really the only rope I can find. You guys have seven minutes and 20 seconds left. Somehow suspend this brick in the air so when someone hits it, it falls on. I'm gonna get some peanut butter right here. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> What the heck? Don't worry about what I'm doing, pal. You can go. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> no, look at that. Isaac, you have two minutes and 45 seconds. Oh, plenty of time. I really messed up. Now, this is much stronger. It's holding. 30 seconds, guys. I gotta get my chip. Three, two, one. Well, take me to the traps. All right, this is a bait trap. I have set some chips laying out. And when the animal gets close, I'm gonna pull this rip cord and the brick will smash his head. My widow ahead. Whoa. All right, Samuel, this is the, the bucket trap. I have a little path because I want the animal to go the path of least resistance. They're not gonna wanna go over these pokey pine cones, so they're gonna come walking in here. Before I activate the trap, I put a string on the middle in here with tape, and it's peanut butter all in oh. this bucket. Bump it, and it falls on it. Okay. Mm. He'll pull the string, so it should shake the barrel and shut it. Yeah, I can't get out no matter what. It's a big squirrel. So, so trapped. Big squirrel. Big squirrel. Definitely can't push that bucket for sure. No, so but hit, that's the thing. I'd be right around the corner and I'd come in and be like, ah! Mine's the most comfortable trap by far. Now see that over there? Yeah. That's yep. a little, that's a, that's a squirrel. Oh, it's an example. I get Yeah, an you. example. So he's, okay. gonna, he's gonna be like, oh my gosh, I see some cheese. Good, he's nibbling the cheese. And I'm up here and I just, bam! Whoa. Do squirrels <laughs> actually like cheese? Yes. I think that's a myth involving mice. Squirrels will eat whatever they can get. They're dirt bags. In principle, I love all of your traps, but <laughs> I actually like Isaac's because I feel like his level of comfort would allow him to sit for an extended period of time mm. waiting for the animal to come. Am I hearing you correctly? You said he won? Yeah, this time he won. Oh, oh wow! Okay. Ever in a million years! He would have scared away the squirrel because the brick. He had to pick up, move it, throw it. Yeah. I girls like it. nuts! For tonight's dinner, I have something especially delicious. Petite filet mignon. Oh yeah. Kind of overcooked it a little bit. It's kind of hard to see in the dark. Uh, don't think they're really done yet. No, no, no. Ah, what the? Oh! What the heck? What? The wind literally blew my house over. My chair, I was sitting in my chair, literally the whole thing flies <laughs> over, lands on the Plinko board. Dude, oh, it went right through it. I can't sleep out here. I need to sleep in one of your houses. You can sleep in mine. <laughs> I was about to come in and tell you, I can't even barbecue because of the wind. I don't think it's safe. It kind of feels like I'm the only option for you 
nuts. <laughs> it smells so good. I brought over my only drink. Oh shoot, my steak. Oh, my gosh. It's, it's smoky in here. <laughs> Carbon monoxide. Oh, that's better. Wait, did you bring your sleeping bag here? Yes. You moved in already? How are you moving in? I didn't move in. I just brought my blanket. Look at that. All right, I'm giving this a bite. Yum. Jonas Brothers popcorn. <laughs> oh, please. For dessert, I found one of these little apple pies. So I'm just going to warm it up on the grill here. Did you bring your chair in here? Yes, it's a heated chair. I'm still wondering what you're gonna do for a bed. Isaac offered and said I could sleep in his, unless you want me to sleep in here. It's gonna cost you to sleep in here, so you can think about your terms. Does it cost me anything to sleep in your house? Just a snuggle. <laughs> All right, I'm sleeping here. <laughs> Is the pie done? Ow, mama! Mm. All right, you wanna come check out the disco room? I will be totally honest. For a $2,000 campsite, kind of mid. Out. This is way smaller than I thought. Hey, this is plenty of space for two of us. Here's the thing. I love having you for tonight, but this can't be like one of those prolonged roommate type situations. We got to get you on your feet tomorrow. Believe me, that's what I want as well. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah. Here are the jammies. I'm going to put these on. The jacket is like super small. I think I'm just going to put my sweater back on. The one thing I said I wanted to get, I didn't actually get, was a new pillow. Well, guys, my chair battery died. It's not giving off any more heat and it's actually pretty cold. I gotta go to the bathroom. I do not like being out here in the middle of the night. Oh gosh! What are you doing out here? <laughs> I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? <laughs> oh, what? Dude! I did! Well, good night guys. Hopefully for the last time. Morning guys. It was so windy last night. It was kind of hard to sleep. You think we would have just started to float, float away in the <laughs> tent? <laughs> oh, Andrew's tent has fallen apart. Actually, my house. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh. I did not anticipate the wind being so bad that it's destroying our shelters. You automatically already get an extra $200. Yeah, I forgot about that. Doc. 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 Doc again? Doc. Marty. Doc. Marty. Marty. Doc. Marty. Doc. Doc. Marty. Doc. Marty. Doc. Oh. Oh, your house. Oh. Please. I'll be so happy for you. Oh. Show me the money! Show me the money! Super bounce! Super bounce! Oh, oh yeah! At the store, getting some supplies for the windstorm. I have $25 today. A big difference in my past two days. Definitely gonna get something to lay on. I'm sick of laying on the ground and the sticks and the rocks. Do you like ice cream? I got my essentials, so I'm gonna be comfortable for sleeping. Oh, it's gonna be a good night. You guys. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna get these for breakfast. Thankfully, I have a little wiggle room with my food budget today. I'm going to be getting this mini meal and a few other snacks. When we started this challenge, it was relatively warm. Now the wind is picking up. I definitely need an upgrade in my outfit. Starting to get a little stinky. It's time to head back to the shelters. Hopefully they're still there. It's been super windy today. We're back at the campsite and Justin's gazebo is even further from the original location. I feel like we're gonna have to stay in our tents for the rest of the day in order for our tents just to not blow away. Uh, do you have one? I sure do, right here, bud. Whoa. We finally got a tent. Found the cheapest one I could find at the store. Never seen this before. It's called Tiny Tents. I'm living large. Look at you. Give me. I'm so yeah. proud of you. <laughs> what is that? What? This says suitable for ages 12 plus. It looks so sick on the package. Where did you find that? It was at REI. I'd assume that a tent is for a human. <laughs> you are having a rough week, pal. <laughs> I don't want to be here anymore. I was just trying to fix my tent, almost blew away. Justin's is stuck in a tree now. <laughs> I still had some food left over from yesterday that I bought, like these hot dogs, so this will be perfect. It's a good thing I got some food yesterday because I don't have a lot today. Ah, it's still cold. It was just burning. Are you guys ready to see Justin's tent? I have royally messed up. Here's my tent, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I can't fit in there. <laughs> I'm literally gonna call this tent company and put them on blast for misleading information on their backs. I'm begging one of you, can I sleep with your tent tonight? <laughs> I'm considering your orange tent for tonight. I'll start the bargaining a certain percent off tomorrow's budget that you get, that I get from whatever so you I, get. I lose that percentage. Yes, that's my offer. How does 30% sound? Sounds good. We have a deal. Welcome home, I'll show you around. Dang, you signed 30% away? I'm still gonna use this, guys. I'm gonna put all my favorite snacks that I bought, <laughs> keep them safe. I have an activity for us. But not a house. I found this game called Class. It was made in Denmark and on sale. Three ways to score. I get the ball in there, okay. you get two of these stuck to you, or you fall in there. I all get points. Ready, go. 
Oh my. Oh! oh wait. Oh. Oh. No! Defense mode. Oh! 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 The board is tilting. Yeah, you're cheating. Ah! Yeah! The comeback has started. Oh no! Yeah! Ah! Yeah! Oh, I hate class. Did I get <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, it's starting to get a little dark. The sun's going down. Tonight, I'm having White Castle Classic Cheese Sliders. I got this when I was at Target. A little waffle iron. So I'm making waffle sliders. Oh, that is sick. That looks good. A little crisp on the outside. Wow, that's the best thing I've eaten this whole challenge. I have one good news report. The wind has stopped. Tonight might be our best night's sleep yet. I got a soft serve ice cream maker. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna get this going and then we can do other activities while we wait, cause it takes about 20 minutes. Oh. So the timer for 20 minutes and we'll come back. It's starting to get cold. I'm just gonna stand in my sleeping bag. What, stand in it? Isn't that why you have a heated chair that you spent $500 on? Battery died. The final drop is tomorrow. If I don't get a big amount, I might cry. What? I should have read this. The freezer bowl must be completely frozen before you? you begin your recipe. Babe, we're never before gonna have ice cream. We're not gonna have ice cream. <laughs> no, no, we're gonna have ice cream. Ice cream, unleash. Oh, oh stop. That looks like a cow's udder. Looks exactly the same as how I put it in. Top off my shake. That is one of the sweetest things I've ever tried. Take a big bite of your bowl. <laughs> From the taste of it, I can tell it's gonna be super good ice cream. Oh, what, what happened? I don't really know. I'm gonna leave you to it. Oh, I'm so excited to sleep tonight. This is what I spent my money on today. Oh! What in the world? Why are you pour? Why are you pouring salt over my house? Oh! <laughs> I'm officially ready for bed now. There's someone giggling outside of my tent. Pouring salt on my tent's not that funny. <laughs> See you in the morning. Good morning, guys. Today is definitely the warmest day so far, and it's not really windy anymore, so that's super nice. I was hoping that it was cold enough last night that the bowl was frozen, and it actually worked. Look, it's turning out really good. No way! What? Mm. I'm gonna attempt to cook these on the grill here. Oh! Whoa, cine rolls! Oh! oh. <laughs> Look, I know it's not much, but it's cinnamon rolls. Yeah, the tops are pretty good. Are you guys ready for the final Plinko drop of this video? I am. I am. Oh, yeah, yeah, me too. Ah! Whoops, that from... This is just a rubble bell. Ah! No, no way. Oh, my God! AI decides my drop method. McFly! Hey, McFly! What? <laughs> you guys not, have you never seen Back to the Future? Your drop methods lately have been very confusing. Oh. Oh. I'm gonna be real creative. Wow. We're at Best Buy now. Can't here. afford anything in here. I'm gonna get one of these bad boys for tent gaming. Also, I gotta pick out a giant TV. I mean, I want this tent to be like the hub. Keep in mind, for today's budget, Justin owes me 30% of whatever you got. So what'd you get? $75. So how much do I get? $22.50. Now we're at the store. Are you guys getting anything or is it just me? <sighs> I mean, Whole Foods is pretty expensive. Since I got the thousand dollar budget again, I'm gonna get some nice steaks again. What I have in my hand is going to make our night the most epic night ever. Look what I found, guys. This is gonna blow your socks off. We're all back from the store. I'm gonna set up my tent and make it just insane. And I kicked out one of my residents for not paying rent. It's totally fine. I, I can go over to uh, my new place at Isaac's. One more night in this tent should be no problem. So one of my splurge items, I got some luxury water, but not just water. I got some collagen powder that I'm gonna mix in to the water to make it a nice, luxurious drink. I'm getting my thing prepped. I'm sorry? <laughs> the reason I brought you guys out here is because I got some tasty treats for you. You like tasty treats? I love tasty treats. I'm hungry as usual. Hey. I spent my whole oh. budget on this birthday pinata. Treat I'm gonna give it one big welly of a oh whack my. with this golf club. Okay. 
What? What is in here? Tacos! Yeah! You your whole budget on tacos and pinatas? It's supposed to be our lunch. I didn't realize it was gonna blast them across the yard. So for my lunch, guys, I really wanted to send it. Beef and beef liver jerky. Yeah, you can smell the liver. Hmm. You can definitely taste the liver. Interesting flavor. And you're probably wondering what I got for dessert. I'll show you tonight. I have noticed that all of Justin's things are in or around my tent again. So I'm not sure if he's expecting to spend the night with me. So yesterday I bought this air mattress, but I didn't realize it wasn't self-inflating. So I actually needed to get a pump. But today I picked one of those up. Yahoo! Yahoo! I didn't really think to check the size. Well guys, here's the new setup in the oh, tent. Dude, this is legit. This is the nicest night of the challenge so far. No wind, and so I can finally get my barbecue cranked up. Just cleaned it out because it was full of milk curds. I think Cole's just supposed to light pretty quick. Isaac's having trouble again with his barbecue. Holy moly. <laughs> I guess that'll work. It was just light straight on fire, I thought. I've done this at home a couple times. I think it's time we check out your hub, that TV. It's gigantic. That's what I'm talking about. First things first. Uh huh. Donuts, because ugh, I've been desperate all day. What are those? I don't know. They're vegan. Oh, they're vegan. <sighs> oh, they're still really good. I might eat the whole thing. Mm. I'm not capping. Oh, dang. You know what pairs good with a donut? What? $9 chocolate, my guys. Whoa. This is black salt caramel. This is what you spent your whole budget on? Yes. <laughs> it actually is really good. What is that? There's a lot of sounds going on outside. What is that? There's dogs barking, but then there's like a squeal. Dude, you're freaking me out. Dude, I've never heard that sound before. Should we go towards it? It's better not be an alien. <laughs> dogs are going nuts. That's what I'm saying. The dogs are upset. And there's some other creature noise that we've never heard before. What the? Oh crap, what? This tree, that's Don't. a... Remember with our Jim Myers experience? This is a Bigfoot sign. Holy heck. I'm not kidding. Oi. Dude, aliens hate British people. Don't do that. <laughs> is that how British people say hi? Oi. Well, the sound has stopped for some reason. So we're gonna go back to the campsite and hopefully this, whatever that was, doesn't appear in our campsite in the middle of the night is now stalking us. That is weird though that it literally stopped, like they were going, the dogs were going nuts and it literally stopped just as we got there. We're back in the hub after that excursion. Oh, I'm like tired. Now it got me all nervous. <laughs> Don't be nervous, aliens can't do nothing. If aliens can come here, they're more advanced than we are. <laughs> That's scary. Actually, cut when I said aliens can't do nothing out, Drew, just in case they can and they watch this video. Leave watch it in, Drew. <laughs> <laughs> The TV. Oh no. We can't watch a movie on this. We'd be better off watching Isaacs try and start a fire. I've had this all week and I was really hoping to barbecue it. Those are ribs? I didn't realize they were ribs. I thought there was brisket. Boneless pork ribs. Oh, I have bread too. Open, open, open. Yes. Gosh, how are we supposed to watch a movie like this? Can barely see what's going on. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's Bill Murray. No, it's not. Bill Murray's in Coneheads. <laughs> no, it's the other guy. No, Coneheads is Bill Murray. Oh my gosh. How is that? That's actually, that's actually really good. It doesn't matter how cold it is. This is seriously good. Literally, the TV has gotten worse as it's been playing. I would like to publicly apologize. Bill Murray is not in Coneheads. <laughs> oh, yes, it's I know that. Dan Aykroyd. It is time for an insane glow party. I brought hundreds of glow sticks. Hundreds? Oh, oh, oh what? That's oh, just what? one box. Oh, you better not leak into my tent. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. I'm cracked. Oh, oh, the oh, my neck. Oh. <laughs> yeah, boy. Oh my gosh. Wow. There's no lights on? These are so bright, it's lit up the whole place. It's so cool. <laughs> All right, well, well, on that note, I think I'm gonna try and go to bed now. Your guy's tent is like rolling over. Really? Yeah, this, yes. this mattress barely fits in here. I fell. Oh! Oh! Oh, oh no. What happened? No. You snapped the tent. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. It's because it's like da down like a hill slope, so I like slid. I fell off sideways off the mattress. No, oh, he's acting like this whole ground we're on is sinking sand. I just made one misstep and slipped. Well, fell over. How could you slip while laying down? <laughs> All right, well, good night, I guess. I think it snowed last night. Our tent is completely flubbered, losted. Ouch, ouch. Don't ouch ouch yourself. Oh! Is that what I think it is? That's it! Yes. Ah, ours is done! We did it! Oh. Yes. We did it! We did it!
did it guys. You already know the subscribe button's down below. Join J2 Country and we'll see you in the next video.